Hi, um, welcome to MC Podcast, aka Men of Culture Podcast today, and um, I want to talk about this anime art, dating story, the experience you and the inexperienced me. As you can uh, guess by the title, it's um one person is very experienced at dating, and the other person is not. It happens to be the female that's extremely experienced at dating. A little too experienced. A little yeah. too experienced. Third, and mind you, she's in high school still, so um. Now, I want to really ask this question to some of y'all. Um, for one, is the main female character a waifu or she's for the streets? Because really, um, the first few episodes, I watched it and uh, she like basically was like, okay with just like- Undressing, bro. You know, giving the goods up the first, the first minute after like the dude asked her out and the, the reason the crazy thing is like he did it like as like a bet like and he Cast lost the bet out, yeah so like but the thing is as i was watching the show she does things that's like she's that's a w woman but then she does other shit that's like as she for the streets now obviously we already have a guess she lets god just hit it like anytime if he, she's if he if he says he wants to do it now it happens right then and there. So, right now, first three episodes, she's kind of for the streets. But, there's a possibility she might be a wife. There's a possibility. But, uh, I just really want to know what's everyone's thoughts on this anime. Because, uh, this one has been a, uh... I don't really know how I feel about it. Like, she just, she kind of throws me off. And, like, one thing for me is, like... I, I explained this to Khalil earlier. It's, like, the Japanese culture is, like, when it comes to, like, relationships and dating... Like, close to something else, but I swear it's, like, you get, before you even hold hands, before you kiss, before you any do that superficial stuff, you have to be in a relationship. You have to be committed to one another in order to have this relationship. So, to see this come out is a little different. Like, it's definitely different. We're not used to seeing stuff like this. So, I think this is the twist that maybe, like, gets you to, like, actually watch it and, like, and like stay in tune. But, like, it's a little weird to see, like, like, if you think about this chick will do it with, like, anybody, right? Or and she'll do anything with anybody. So, like, does that make him any more special than anybody else? Like, like I want this person to care about our main character, not just care about what they're in, right? Like, a relationship. Yeah. Like, just the superficial stuff. Like, obviously, she's inexperienced in a real relationship where there's give and take on both ends. So, we're going to see if they actually grow together and develop a relationship and fix their issues or they're just gonna go on and make it like a uh, happy-go-lucky slice of life kind of like happy moments type stuff so. i mean i i can say this right now um if that was me if i was in the first episode and uh i would have been like what and he got that option like this all ripple i'd roll the dice to the end. All right, yeah, yeah. See, this this is the issue. This motherfucker is everybody else she dated. All right. <laughs> okay. All right. He's done. Yo. He's out of here. Yo. He's like, yo, she might be for the streets, but if it was me, yeah. You're not gonna say, but look, look, you're not gonna say no to it. Um, uh, but yeah, uh, I'm gonna keep watching this. Uh, it, it has me hooked in in the, in the sense that I want to know where it goes, but the moment I have an idea of it, and if I determine she's for the streets, I'm dropping this shit. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if she's a wife or not. MC Podcast signing out. Editor Khalil, um, just in case anybody feels like, I don't know if everybody's there offended by this video. I mean, dude, it, I just want to say, like, we're half joking, okay? Half joking. That's all I have to say.